Dude, welcome to Canada. Thanks, man. You know what, though? It's really hot over here. I thought I was going to need a winter jacket for party. <laughs> it's summer. Yeah, but I didn't know Canada even had summer, dude. You guys just looking like this. Anyway, you guys got any uh, good coffee places around here? Dude, just wait until you try Tim Hortons. So, what did you think? It was okay. This a dumb American thinks he's too good for Tim Hortons. I'll show him. Wait a minute. I could totally mess with him right now. This is the most Canadian day of his life. No Dunkin' Donuts, but maybe just something. So let me tell you a little bit more about Canada. Dude, you need something way more Canadian than that. Did they play any other music besides Drake on this Canadian No, obviously not. They only play good artists. Dude, where's your bag of milk? Oh yeah, we just bagged ourselves to, you know, fend off wild beavers. You guys do anything but watch hockey. You can buy stuff with that. And she like bumped into me and I said sorry, but then she also said sorry, but then I didn't even know what she was talking about it. Dude, do you, have you always talked like this? It's like 80 degrees. Don't you mean like 25? No. This was me when I was like in grade one. Grade one? Yeah, grade you mean, one. You mean the first grade? Man, nothing's happening. Are you sure this is how you get maple syrup? Here, these are the nearest to Canada. You're gonna have to memorize them by tomorrow. This is your national anthem? Yeah. <laughs> it looks like a little boy wrote these. Dude, wake up! You're gonna miss the wild moose hunt. You gotta get, get off me. Oh my god, I'm so sick of all this Canadian shit. I'm just gonna go back to the States. Wait, before you go have a confession. It's too late for stories. I'm leaving. Okay, well, uh, I guess see you in November when Trump's president. Love when the sun's come.